Nico, get in the bunker. Okay, I'm going. Oh! Oh! Hurry. Oh! Yeah, no, I don't know if the bunker survived, guys. Oh, man. They never do. What do you mean? Sometimes they do. Really? I'm pretty sure we always die. Has there been one time where our bunker hasn't been destroyed? I mean, there was that one time. Whoa! Ah, uh, finally, school is over. Uh, thank goodness. I can now go home and relax. True beans. Wait, what is that sound? What is that? Oh, gosh. What's going on? Oh, no. I hear a siren. Did you guys hear that, too? Yes. It's loud. Ah! What did you say? Shady, why are you breakdancing to this? Because it's fire. This is like some dubstep. Turn around. I can't hear you, Mia. Turn around. Hey. Hello? You five, we need to go to the blank house right now. Let's move. What? The blank house? Yes, follow me. The president wants to speak with us. The president wants to speak with us? Cash just said that. I know. It's probably related to the sound. Oh, gosh. Why would he want to speak with a little bougie man? I don't know. Who's the bougie man? I don't know. It's you. Yo, that's you, Nico. That's not me, Mia. Little bougie man. Let's see what President Cube needs to tell us. President Cube! Ah, uh, perfect. Finally, you guys are here. All right, President Cube. What is happening to Square City right now? Listen, first of all, I just needed to make sure y'all was safe. And uh, second of all, that was my fault. I accidentally pressed a button that sent a nuke to Square City. Huh? Wait, what? Uh, yeah. This is your nuke button? You did not. Wait, what is this button over here? Coffee? Well, I was trying to get some coffee, and I pressed the wrong one. Wait, so if you just want coffee, you can press this button? Yeah. Wait, let me try. Uh, did it work? He's on your left, buddy. Wait, what? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> so, you just get coffee on demand with one button? Yes, I do. Why is it the same color as your nuke button? Well, I don't know. I just wanted to have some symmetry. You know what I mean? Oh, my gosh. Uh, I didn't want to have two different colors. It wouldn't have looked good. So what are you trying to tell us, sir? That the city's going to be destroyed and uh, we only have about 20 minutes until that thing drops on us. Oh gosh, guys, this is horrible! What the bougie? No, this is really, really bad. I wanted to tell you guys first because it may give you some time to head to a bunker or some sort of doomsday place. I don't know. We don't got no bunker. Are there any bunkers in Square City? I don't think so. Yeah, me neither. Shady, do you have any bunkers? Uh-uh. Oh gosh, wait, what are you doing over there? Hey, come back! I'm just checking out this room, bro. Uh, Oh, wait, is this where you do news broadcast, President? Yeah, that's my green room. Anyways. You should probably tell the Square City residents that the whole city's gonna be going down. Wait, I'm going live right now, actually. Wait, what? Hey, buddy, don't go live on my green room camera. Hello, Square City. Wait, Shady. The President has launched a nuke, and you will all die. Don't panic. Oh, gosh. But you are all going to die in like 20 minutes. Oh, no, no. Let me speak to him. This is bad. This is not good at all. Listen, Square City, everything's under control, all right? You can just stay in your houses and you'll all be fine. Don't worry about it. We should probably head out of here. Oh, we need to get safe. I don't want to die. I don't think the president's got our backs. You know what? We need to get our own backs. True that. You know who always has our back? Who? Mebo. Mebo. That's so true, Cat. <laughs> oh, you know what? We should ask Mebo. Mebo. I know, because if we all explode, at least he'll survive. All right, call Mebo over, Mia. Oh, well, we could have visited him, but sure, I guess. Hello? Mebo? Hello, what is it? Can you come over to my location and bring us creative keys, please? We're at the Blank House. Why does it say you're with the president? Oh, yeah, I forgot. I saw his broadcast and I saw Shady on TV. I forgot. Okay, so Mebo has beef with the president. We'll be outside so he doesn't see you. Wait, what? Beef? I don't have beef with him. He just doesn't like me. Mebo, oh my gosh. I have so many questions. Okay, Mebo, just meet up with us. I see him right there. Hello. Hey, Mebo, what's up? We probably want to get you away from the blank house. I was going to give you the key. Wait, what? I already got a creative key? Ugh, wait, I'm in creative mode. Why'd you make that noise? <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, creative key. Oh. Whoa. Oh, I guess we all do it. I don't know. I need some sort of sound effect. Oh. Anyways, thank you, Mebo. You're welcome. I need to go charge because now I'm only on 57%. Are you serious? Oh, gosh. Yes. Guys, we need to make a do Doomsday Bunker now. Oh, where do we make it? I don't know, but I have an idea. We have a special announcement. We are making personalized videos. Great for those big Cash and Nico fans and birthdays. A video just for you. From Nico and I, personalized videos available at cashandnico.com. All right, guys, do you see this right here? Yes. Yes, Martin. The exit. This normal tunnel. We're going to turn this into a Doomsday Bunker. Let's turn it into a boring tunnel. Ew, no. What do you mean? Mia, I have a sick idea for a Doomsday Bunker. It's gonna have a man cave and everything. Okay, for starters, no man cave, and two, this looks like an egg. What? What do you mean? <laughs> it does look like an egg. Very egg-shaped. How about I demos it? No, 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 
no. Shady. Yeah. The president already set the nuke on Square City. We don't need two. You're right. Yeah, exactly. You know what? Let's make our last 20 minutes of life a competition. What? I bet you that Zoe and I can build a better doomsday bunker than you guys can. Yeah, I bet our bunker will survive and yours will get destroyed. What? Well, yours looks like it's already destroyed. What is that? I saved it. Hey, 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 what is that thing? Phobos. Oh, no, no, no. Ah! It's attacking him! Yo! It's attacking him! Yo, Joe! Good luck with that, guys! Yo, get this thing off me! Hey, bro, relax. See you later, girls. It's the boys' time to shine. Bro! Oh, Shady, are you serious? What? Shady, no more explosions or else. Hey, bro, I didn't even light that thing, so I don't even want to hear it out of your mouth, young man. It was cute! No, I just saved it. What do you mean? Okay. I don't know where it came from. All right. What we're going to do for the start of this doomsday bunker is obviously on every single nuclear bunker, there's a little radioactive symbol on top of it. So first, we're going to make it the entrance. We're going to start by setting this entire wall to gray concrete, just like this. All right. And we're going to change all these blocks. This is no longer going to be an exit to Square City. This is going to be our nuclear bunker. I just realized if anyone wants to exit Square City, wouldn't this block them from it? You know what? Whatever. We don't have to worry about that. All right. That looks good. And whoa, Cash, what are you doing? Are you building a little vacation spot out here? Here. Oh, yeah. You know, you're gonna only have 10 minutes of joy, right? Because a nuke is coming straight for us right now. So? I could get a tan while I'm waiting for it. Okay, fine. Nah. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna replace these stone bricks to be more secure. And also, whatever this stripped dark oak wood is. First, we're gonna start off with the edges, and we're gonna replace that with some iron blocks. So let's do such as replace hand with iron blocks, just like this. And now, we have iron blocks as the border. And then we probably wanna replace the spruce planks as well. So let's make these to netherite blocks. And let's do the same command right there. Boom! Look how good that looks. All right, so, like, what we really trying to get out of this build? Uh, you'll see in a second, Shady. All right, Martin. And then after that, we want to replace these stone bricks, and we probably want to replace them with a lighter block. So let's replace them with smooth quartz. Just like this. Okay, bougie. That looks good. And then now, I want to replace this inner part with polished deep slate, but we could easily do that with our hand. Because, obviously, we don't need world editor for everything, or else that would take out the fun of it. All right, perfect. And then now, look at this. This inner part is going to be a different color. We're going to make this entire inside part yellow. So we're going to get a wand right here. Select on both sides, just like this. And now we could set that to yellow concrete. Or actually, we could replace it with yellow concrete. Boom. And now let's fill up these corners right here. And next, we're going to build the radioactive symbol in the front. And also, there's these little slivers of blocks I should probably replace as well. So that's good. Fix that up right there. Boom. And then now, we're going to get some black concrete. And this is where the fun part comes in. We're going to build the little radioactive symbol. So we're going to go like this. And then go like that. And then go like that. And then go like that. Okay. I don't know if that looks good. Uh, no, that looks buns. Oh my gosh. I did not cook. I think we're going to start off in the middle right here. And let's place right there. And then on the edges, we're gonna go like this. And we want this sort of design. This might not look that good, but we'll cook when we get to the end. Okay, I think I'm actually cooking with this. So we wanna go like this on that side and then do the same on this side over here. And then we wanna do the same to the bottom. Just like that. Okay, I think that looks better. Let's just expand this design downward like this. Cash, I may need help here. I'm not gonna lie. I think he fell asleep. Are you serious? Oh my gosh, he did! Brother dead. I need to take things into my own hands then. All right, Shady, you know what? What's up, Martin? You can work on this design while I work on the inside, okay? Okay. Because okay. I need to cook, and I think you're probably better at doing that. All right. So I think next, we're going to cut off this exit on the other side real quick by replacing this whole thing with smooth quartz. So let's set all of this to smooth quartz. And we probably want to replace all this polish and aside as well. <sighs> hey, Cash, what's up? I'm tired of the sun. He woke up from his nap. Oh, all right. There we go. Cash, do you want to help build the interior of this thing? Yeah, where are we going? First thing we're going to do is we're going down. Because obviously, we can't survive on the surface. It's going down for real. All right. I think this deep should be good. So you know what? We're going to select a big region going down. But also, I think we should make it like a cylinder shape. Should I keep digging right here? I think I'm gonna just keep digging, yeah. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna do a quick world edit command to hollow out a huge area. Oh, you digging right there, fam. So let's see if this is big enough. Boom. Burr. Oopsies. Boom. Alright, do you think this is wide enough, Cash, or should I make it smaller? Dude, you cut me also. Sorry. Yeah, I think this is wide enough for show. Okay, so let's make this go to the surface. So let's make this go 35 blocks high. Okay, that looks good. And I think we just missed the surface right there, which is perfect. So now we're gonna make the entrance of the doomsday bunker right here. And Cash, you could cook on the bottom. Bottom. All right, I'll let you take over that. I'll cook on the bottom. I think I want to make the interior a different color. So actually, let me help you out on the interior real quick. We should place the entire walls with gray concrete. Okay, bouge. So I'm gonna select all the way over here. Boom. Then I'm gonna go all the way over here. <laughs> I don't know. Oh my gosh. Nico, what was the width of the cylinder? It was 15. All right. And then I'm going to select all the way over here real quick. And let's just cover all this up. Now we can replace this all with gray concrete. Boom. Check that out. And then also, I think we might need to fix the roofs, but this is looking a whole lot better. All right. Shady, how's the outside cooking? Oh, it's looking great, brother. Shady, it is not looking great. There's no progress that happened up there. Don't worry about it. I'm sabotaging the girl's base right now. But you are? Okay, infiltrate them. Let me know what theirs looks like. Okay, I will. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to replace this ground. 
around, and I think we want to make this an industrial block. So I'm thinking we're going to place this with some deep slate tiles. Boom. Okay, this is looking a lot better up here, guys. I'm not going to lie. I think what I'm doing is I'm going to change this polished deep slate. And we're going to need to make a security door in order to prevent, first of all, the nuclear explosion from coming in, and then random people from coming in. We do not want the girls to be able to infiltrate our base. That is very factual. All right, I'm just going to make this curvature of the base a lot better. And what we could do is we could get some stairs to do that. Stairs help with the overall design and architecture. So I'm just going to do that. And we could also get some slabs too. Pro building tip. If we use slabs and stairs, you can make things look a lot more rounded. Just like that. I don't think that looks that good. I think I'm going to go like that for the top. Okay, perfect. That looks good. Now let's do the same thing on this side. Right here by going like this. Placing down right here. And doing the same design on both sides. Oh! Are you okay? What would happen down there? I got a virus! Wait, what? Oh! Come outside the base! Are you? Are you? Oh my gosh. Go to the girls' base, bro. Wait, where's the girls' base? It's that way. You're going the right way. Oh! Whoa! Okay, guys, I think the nuclear effects are kicking in. This is why we need to make the bunker. I dropped an ender bomb on Zoe and Mia. Oh gosh, okay. You can't move! I guarantee Zoe doesn't even notice the lag difference. <laughs> she already plays on 15 FPS. All right, I'm going to place this with Polish Deeps, Erica. Guys, I'm focusing on the base. You guys go continue trolling. Okay, Boogie. We need to help sabotage the girls. So I'm going to select right there. And then I'm going to go all the way over here. And let's replace the ceiling of this thing. And I think for the ceiling, I'm going to replace this with Polish Deep Slate. And also, Cash, you cooked on the floor right here. This is looking amazing. I'm not done yet. Maybe we should have a pole with a staircase winding up to the top. Maybe I could do that. That way we could go up and down and we could build multiple levels to this doomsday bunker. That'd be sick. Oh, I like that. I like that. Yes. Oh, I like that. This is looking... Oh, gosh. And I don't know where I put the entrance to this place. I think it should be in the middle. Okay, perfect. There we go. And we have officially cooked. Shady, what are you doing down here? What is that? It's about the bus. Ah! I'm frozen. Uh, Shady, why is there a bunch of ghost spiders here? I am frozen. Oh my gosh. Oh, holy smokes, toilet. Shady, kill all of them. I can't. <laughs> Mia, Zoe, help. <laughs> Somebody kill our E. Uh, Shady, I don't know what happened, but you know what? I'm just going to ignore that. Really, Boogie? It was just a wee bit of trolling. We could really not have Shady in here. I'm not going to lie. You know what? I know exactly what to do, though. It's fine, Shady. Just start behaving. I'll go work with the girls. Wait, what? No. Please. I have an idea of what we should do for this one, Cash. Word. I'm gonna make a doomsday door. Do it. At the top right here. So we could easily do that by making a piston door. And let's do that on both sides. First, we need to clear out an area right here. Just like this. Basically, it'll be a door that we could activate with a simple lever. So we need to connect this all with redstone. So we need to get some redstone repeaters right here. And then connect them on all the sides. Now we just need to connect all these sides. Let's go. I'm breaking all this stuff. But once it's done, it'll cook. Trust me. Now we just connect the redstone around this little prohibitor. Oh, yeah. This is gonna be awesome. Okay. And then when we flick a lever right here, it should activate. Uh oh, it only activates one side. Probably because we need repeaters on all the sides. So let's go out here and set a repeater in that direction. And then a repeater over here. And then a repeater over here. Here. Boom. And also, I'm gonna disconnect this side right here. Yo, this contraption is huge, brother. What do you mean? Like, what is going on here? It's called Pro Building Shady. Okay. Okay, and then what we need to do is put our block of choice on all four sides. And then now look at that. It works! That is sick. But also, I'm pretty sure we can't make the door in the middle, so I'm just gonna make our staircase down the middle just to make this work. Cash, what the proby butt is going on? What are you saying, Shady? Hey, guys, I'm sorry. I'm putting a pole inside of this entire thing. I got a surprise for you. Shady! Ah! Oh my gosh. What is going on? There was ghost miners. Shady, that's because you spawned them in. Holy smokes, the ghost miners are here. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, give me a second. All right. Now that we have this pole in the middle, when we activate it, it is much more simple. Now all we have to do is we have to fill up all of this redstone that I just placed. Nico, come check this out, bro. Okay, give me a second, Shady. No, no, come down here right now. Wait, what? This is important. Okay, yeah. Look what he did, bro. He broke your pillar. I wouldn't let that slide. Hey! No, no, it's fine. Some random pillar got world edited through here. Don't worry about it. I personally wouldn't let that slide, though. But yeah, if you just want to be like a little baby. Are you calling me a baby, Shady? Yeah, bro. I would do something about it. Okay, fine. Hey, Cash. Check this out. Boom. Oh, yeah. You tell him, bro. I'm joining the girls. See y'all. Hey. Yo, Cash, bro, I would not let that slide if I was you. Cash, you can come back, please. Yo, Cash, bro, I would not let that slide. I would start spawning item fireworks right now. Oh, no. Okay, I'm just gonna place these deep slate tiles on the top real quick. And Shady, do you think you can recruit our teammate back? He could not be caught on the girl side. Yeah, I'll go get him. Trust me, he's gonna regret that. And then Shady never fixed this thing right here. So I'm gonna just do it myself. And I think what we could do to make this look a little bit better is if we get our brush, we could actually work on the sides a little bit more. So let's expand this right here by going with our pencil and upping the thickness. 
And we can add these little things on each side, which will help out with the depth. Oh, hey, Cash, welcome back. Hey, you're not talking to me. Oh, gosh, he's giving me the silent treatment. Hey, Cash, you can break my pillow. I was just joking. Shady made me mad, so I did it. Okay, I'm just gonna add that design on all four sides. So let's go right here. I'm gonna add this right here. And then I'm gonna do the same on the bottom, like this. Okay, boom. Oh, yeah, that is so much better for the middle. Are you serious? I actually cooked. All right, now I'm gonna do the brush, and I'm gonna do the same thing with the bottom. So let's go right here, and let's expand this pencil right here. And let's go like this. Okay, that looks so much better. And then on these corners, I'm gonna add these little corner designs, just like this. Perfect. That's one corner right there. And then we could do that on the other corner as well. All right, boom. Look at that. Oh, that is looking so much better. I think I might, I might wanna add these on the bottom, though. That could be a lot better. Boom, that looks good. And then now, that looks good. All right, perfect. It's a little bit laggy here, but it's fine. As long as the design looks sick. And then now on these corners, I'm gonna add a little curvature right here. It's quite easy to do that. All you gotta do is do this on all four sides. Perfect. That is one side, and then that is another side. Okay, yeah. Wait, no, that does not look good. Okay, I think that looks a lot better. And then what we wanna do for the actual entrance is I'm gonna break two concrete blocks right here. And I'm actually gonna replace this with a hidden door. And let's do that by getting a door right here. And we could actually do this with a, a secret iron door like this and place it right there. And then we want a redstone circuit connecting from all the way there. Oh gosh, I broke the bottom of it. All the way down here to a button right over here. And we're gonna make this a white button. And then it's gonna say, enter doomsday bunker. Oh yeah. And now we can get glowing sacks and yellow dye. And now we have a simple button that will lead into here. But we need to connect the redstone. So let's do that. And I might have to mine some stuff. So it might ruin the design, but you know, we'll just rebuild it. We could have the bunker lead into a redstone circuit that goes into the back of this button. Now you press the button, it should ignite this redstone. And then now all we have to do is lead the redstone all the way over to the door like that. And then now all I have to do is cover up what we just broke. And obviously we have to repeat the design, which isn't that difficult. So now whenever we click this button, it opens the door. Perfect. But also obviously we see below. So I'm going to replace some depolished deep slate right here to remove any of the hidden redstone. And then also place some smooth coarse blocks all along here. And I'm going to replace the bottom of these as well. Because you see that little sliver of grass and that does not make anything look good. All right, that is our doomsday entrance done. Now, if we click this button, we can enter right here. Perfect. Click this lever. Oh, gotta cover up this redstone. Click this lever and now we can open it up and check this out. We have this underneath here. And oh gosh, I think I made Cash bad. He gave me the silent treatment. So now I'm gonna start working on this interior. I think I'm gonna expand on what Cash was doing down here. So I, I wanna make this a tropical paradise. So we should probably add some water down here. Let's first replace this bottom layer right here with water. Let's place air water. Nice. And then we can get water buckets and then fill in the corners just like this. Okay, that looks good. And then now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place some simple sand patches on each of these corners. And then I wanna place a tropical tree. So I think we wanna get the right sapling, of course. And I'm thinking a palm tree would be the best. And I'm pretty sure you can place those palm trees on sand. Let's just see if we can. Oh, yeah. And then now if we get some bone meal, we can now place these trees all around. So let's do that. Let's build these on the corners real quick. And you know what? Let's go here. shady has been gone for an awful long time. I think he might be with the girls to by now. Am I the boys to by myself? Maybe I should give him a call. Hello? Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Oh, hey, Shady, what's up? Hey, what's going on? How did you know I was calling you? Oh, I just got the notification on my phone and then came over here. Okay, well, can you tell me what happened with Cash? He was wearing a wig. He's on the girls' team? Yes. So he's abandoned us. He has abandoned us. Okay, it's fine. Don't worry about it. We're gonna make this a tropical paradise down here, and they're gonna be so jealous. Ah, yeah, we could do that. All right, I think I wanna make a rope leading down to the bottom, and I think we could do it just like this, and we could make this rope go all the way down here. That way we could easily access this doomsday bunker and go up and down. So let's see if this works. If I climb this rope right here. Oh, yeah, I'm able to climb it. That is so much better. And then now we can attach this all to the block right here. And that looks good. All right, now if you want to climb down, you can just go all the way down and clutch just like that. And let's think. Shady, I think I want some beach chairs right here. I think I like the rope a lot better. You like the rope? Yeah, me too. Instead of the pillar. I think we can honestly break a lot of the pillar. Yeah. We still need this top block right here. So I'm just going to leave it there. I bet. Or actually, I'm going to change our polished deep slate. Now if we click it, looks like that. Boom. Okay, yeah. Now let's make the rope go all the way down. And then I want to add some beach chairs. So let's add a deck chair right here. Place it that way with a tiki chair on next to it. Do the same over here. Add a tiki chair. And I'm not gonna lie, there's no survival instinct here. So you know what? We need to add some fridges. Like a hundred fridges or what? No, not like a hundred fridges. Just a few over on this side. Oh. I think over here I'm gonna make a little food stand in case we ever need food. So I'm gonna place a fridge right here, just like this. And then I'm gonna go with a slab and I'm gonna place around like so. Just like that. I'm gonna go over top. I'm gonna do the same. Then I'm gonna go in with some item frames. And we're gonna have some food options right here. Let's go with some beach food. I'm gonna get a popsicle. And then I'm gonna get a sweet berry sundae, coconut, a vegetable sandwich. Actually, no, I do not want a vegetable sandwich here. And a baguette. Obviously, we need a baguette. Baguettes are tropical, right? No. Baguettes feel tropical to me, so I'm doing it. All right. I mean, that makes no sense, but we could call it 
tropical. Yeah, exactly. All right, this is looking good. Honestly, Shady, I think besides beds, I think our doomsday bunker is done. Wait, should I place a bed for Cash or no? He's an enemy. He's on the enemy territory. Um, I mean, we don't even really have any bedrooms. Still placing one for me and you. They're right next to each other. What? It's okay. They're one block apart. Don't worry about it. Oh, okay. That's good. All right. And now our doomsday bunker is done. Oh, yeah. Now if we close this, we have a completely open door. We even have an outside. Oh, gosh. I need a button to get out of here. Here, I'll let you out. Or I need a pressure plate to get out of here. Boom. Okay, perfect. And look at that. That honestly looks really good. That does look good. But we probably should be careful because I think this nuke would blow a hole in the top of the mountain. Oh, you're right. Uh, oh, gosh. Should we check out the girls' bunker before? Yeah, it's right here. Okay, let's go. Hey, girls. Uh, Hold on. Let me log back on. What is this? Uh, oh, hello, Martin. Oh, my gosh. Wait, may I just join the game? Yeah. You're not allowed in. Okay, I'm going through. Boo. Nah, he ignored you. Through the lasers. No. Sorry, Zoe. I'm coming in. Well, what's the password? Exactly. One, two, three, four. Hey. How did you know? Whoa. This is sick. Hey, why is he down here? He can't be in our girls' base. That's what I'm saying. What do you mean? You can't be in the girls' base. Cash, you're not a girl. You're a boy. I'm part of the girls' team, aren't I? Oh, gosh. I think that means I'm a girl. Okay, fine. You're a girl. Gosh. Well, can you guys show us around at least? Here's our base. Here's our base. Wow. Wait, there's a whole gaming setup here? No, it watches outside. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Ooh, Cash, I don't even recognize you. Wait. Word? Hey, yo, what is this? Word. No. What? Why is there a red bed here? Because I sleep up here, too. It's Cash. Bed. Okay, whatever. I didn't place your bed in my base anyways. Gosh. Word. Okay, let's see this. Well, you, you guys have helicopters too? Yeah, and we got Trish over there. Yeah, just in case. And Barbie and Sandy. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, you know what? Your guys' base is pretty good, not gonna lie. Thank you. Should we go visit my base real quick? Yeah, for sure. Let's see it. Hopefully the nuke doesn't drop. This is gonna be buns delicious. No, it is not buns delicious. It is good delicious. What? Booty delicious. All right, welcome to me and Shady's boys' base. Ooh. All right, we enter right here. Do the enter the doomsday bunker button. Boom. Gross. And then right here we have a hidden door. Oh. Flick it. Open it right here. Oh, oh, it was close. So now I gotta open it. Oh, yeah. Huh. Now we got a rope right here. I wonder who built this tree down here. Oh, this is really cool. I know. We, we're going with a little tropical theme. I like it. You could be protected and all like tropical. I know, right? This is what reminds me of when Nico and Cash got angry at each other. What do you mean? Well, they were fighting over a pillar. Oh, gosh. Dude, you're not building your river through my base. Oh, sorry, Cash. Wait a second. Oh, gosh. I'm in survival. And, oh, gosh. All my items are gone. You have to climb the rope. Oh, great. No, no, no. I was just about to watch Lil Baby's stylish Atlanta Oasis. Doesn't that mean that Nuke is coming? Well, that's not good. Oh, no. Well, you're at the boys' base. You're not supposed to be at the boys' base. We gotta get you guys to the girls' base. Come on. Get me back to my base. I think we just survive in here. Oh, gosh, wait. The rope isn't long enough. Uh, nah. Oh, no. I guess we're stuck in the tropicalness. Good thing I have extra rope. Oh, thank you, Cash. Okay, we gotta get you guys out of here. President Cube. Hey, how y'all doing here? You know what President Cube, what is with that suit? It's to protect from radiation. Okay, whatever. We're going outside. I'm staying in your base. Wait, we gotta take the girls back to their base. Yeah, we gotta go. Let's go to the base. Come on, girls. Okay. Is their base better? All right. No, President Cube, you can stay in my base. All right. See you guys later. Wait, what was that? Oh, no, I gotta take off my book bag. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. What was that? Guys, I think I just saw something drop on your base. Yeah, no, I'm going back to yours. I think our base is gone. I'm frozen. <laughs> uh, guys, I think the girls' base just got exploded. It's gone. Oh, no. Sorry, girls. I guess our boys' base was just better. Wait, what? Not you switching sides. That is wild. Nah, the switch up is crazy. Uh. Oh! Yeah, your base blew up, too. Guys, come on. Okay. The president's asking for us. Oh, great. Uh, finally, y'all are here. President Cube, what do you want? Listen, I just wanted to come by and say hi to y'all. I missed you guys. Well, that's awesome. Yeah. Okay, is that it? Is that what he came to us for? Oh, yeah, and also, um, I'm about to hit this nuclear button and Square City might blow up. Wait, what? Well, you see, we have about five minutes, but let me explain myself. Triangle Town's trying to kill us and they're sending bombs over, so I'm going all out on them. I'm airing that place out. So what do you want us to do? Uh, I just wanted to warn you guys, obviously, so you don't die in a fiery explosion. Oh, gosh. We're doomed. I'm going on my presidential plane. Out of here. Y'all can just uh, save yourselves, I guess. How are we going to save? ourselves. Can I come on the plane? No, buddy. All right. Cash, no, you have to stay here with us. Well, it would have been better to go on that plane. Well, what are we going to do? Our houses are going to explode. Not if I got something to say about it. Well, what do you have something to say about it, Cash? I'll talk to that nuclear bomb. You know what I'll do? I'll pull up to Triangle Town and mog everybody. Wait, you know what, guys? I don't think either of those solutions will work. Talking to the bomb won't help at all. True. And Shady, even though you mog, I don't think that's going to help either. Okay, Martin. And I have a new plan. What's your plan, boss? I'm looking at it. What? Mia. No. Don't you got a plan? Dude. 
I have lots of plans, but I don't want to share them with you. Call up me, Bella. Oh, my gosh. Fine. But you guys have to listen to the phone call. Okay. Bebo, hello. What is it? You guys need creative keys again? Yes, sir. Yes, it's Nico's fault. How did I know? Wait, wait, wait. Can I ask Meebo something, too? Sure, but don't get him to block me, okay? Okay, Meebo. Hey, give me the phone. Sorry, yeah. Thank you. Meebo, can you bring a burger, too? I'm really hungry. Yeah, I can bring a burger. Zoe, this is a time of crisis. Make sure it has only ketchup and pickles on it. Thank you. Okay, also hot dog, please. Okay. What? No hot dog. Okay, you know what? Whatever, guys, come along. Okay. I know exactly what we have to do. We're going to to create a bunker so we could survive underground. <gasps> what an amazing idea! Because if everything above ground is going away, then we need to stay safe underground. Avi. Wait, Mebo! I brought your guys' creative keys and your food. Okay. Oh, thank you. Wait, I didn't get the hamburger. Let's Zoe. Nah, get a burger. Give me the burger. Oh, thank you, Mebo. And let's go! We're creative mode! Okay, can I go back underground now? Yeah, sure, but you might want to come with us, Mebo. I don't think Mia's lab is very safe. No, I'm working on my security base downstairs. Wait, what? It's only big enough for me. Hey! Sorry. Dang. I kind of like his vibe, though. He's like a lonely loner Sigma. True. Okay, guys. Maybe we should probably save some Square City people, too. Like who? I don't know. Some place that we can survive for a very long time. Okay, Bean. Some place that has food, so we can have an infinite supply. The grocery store! I'm confused. You wanted to save people, or you wanted to find a place to build? Find a place to build as well. I'm trying to eat. Boy, Zoe always trying to eat with her big mouth. <laughs> Okay, you know what? Calm down, guys. Where's Juliet? I don't know. Maybe she's on her break. A break during this time, Mia? You know, legally, they have to give her one. She doesn't get paid. Oh, yeah, true. The grocery store is closed. Please leave the premises. Wait, what? No! <laughs> hey, Juliet, are you back? I'm so distraught, Nico. Uh, because a nuclear missile is going to hit Square City. What? Why were you distraught? I dropped my ice cream cone during my break. Oh, my gosh. There are way worse problems than that, Juliet. Here. <laughs> I know exactly what we need to do. We need to turn this grocery store into a nuclear bunker. Ooh, for free? Yes, Juliet, we have creative mode. Good, because I don't know if you know this, but I don't get paid here. Uh, yeah, I think I did know that. Juliet, I got you, bruh. I got you with a wage. All right, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna suck over here, and then I'm gonna go all the way up on this corner, and we're gonna set this to iron blocks. All right, we're changing the whole walls right here. Boom! Now the entire thing is iron blocks. Let's see. Does that look good? Oh, I think I missed the wall. Oopsies. All right, and done! Now we have all the walls set to iron blocks. Okay, sorry, Julia. We're gonna need to take everything down a little bit. No, no worries. What happened to you? I just got my first paycheck. Nice. Uh, I'm real bougie now. Okay, everyone make sure they put all this stuff inside chests because I'm getting rid of everything inside this store. Okay, boogie. All right, we should have saved everything. So now I'm cutting the whole entire store. Bob. Ah. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. It is now hollow. Okay. Oh, and now the items are on the floor. Oh, uh, cash. What? You put all the chicken in your inventory? Well, uh, sorry. Uh. Oh, my gosh. Okay, you know what? I'm changing the floor and the ceiling now. Let's select over here and then so let's select all the way over here. Let's do some deep slate for that. Ooh, that's something. Okay, so I have a question, Bougie. Uh, yeah, Shady. So why are we building a nuclear bunker above the ground? Well, I was getting to that. Well, I was getting to that. Shady, of course we're building it underground. Well, I don't know. It looked like you're putting a lot of effort into the top of it. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't realize that. Oh, gosh, guys. I heard you. Uh, you did? Okay, we're switching the ground to deep slate bricks. We need to start digging, boy. No, no, you're right. Okay, you guys can work on the bottom. I'll work on the top. Okay. Okay, I'm setting the roof to deep slate bricks as well. I need to reinforce this place. Oh, I don't want to die. Well, obviously none of us do, yet. But you know what? Sometimes we have to get through our problems and face them head on. <laughs> Are you making fun of me? That's what you sound like. Ooh. Mia, that's not very nice. You need to apologize to him. Never. And you need to give him a foot massage. Hey, yo! Funny! All right, now that we see the outside of this, we all we have to do is replace the brown terracotta and the gray terracotta with a different block. So let's replace that with blocks of netherite. All right, boom! And then now that we replace that, we should probably replace this block as well. This is stripped dark oak wood. So let's replace all that with deep slate bricks. Boom. And check that out. That looks a lot better. And now we need to replace these dark oak stairs with deep slate stairs as well. And that looks a whole lot better. Now, let's see. I think in order to indicate that we want to make this a nuclear bunker, we should probably make a nuclear sign here. Oh, good idea. And the way to make a nuclear sign is we got to get rid of this sign first. We need to get some yellow concrete and then some black concrete and we're going to need to make a circle and it's a bit hard to make a circle in minecraft so we're going to need to cook first we're going to start off with five blocks just like this and then build around just like so and we're going to make this pretty big to indicate that this is a safe and friendly bunker all right and in order to make this symmetrical done wait shady that is a genius idea <laughs> wait i didn't even think of that i think you're going to need to make that a little smaller and let me make a background for that that is perfect what the heck yeah hold on let me center it real quick okay there we go wait let me see i like that oh yeah 
Oh, wait. That looks so much better than what I was planning. Wait, can you shift it to the left a little bit? Hold on, hold on. I'm shrinking it. Is that small enough? Or you want it smaller? I want it to the left a little bit more. A little bit smaller. A little smaller. Okay. How about this? Okay, yeah. Okay, and then you said to the left? Uh, a little bit more to the left. A little more? Oh, yeah, that's perfect. Okay. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no. I'm tweaking. I'm tweaking. Oh, my goodness. Now, all we have to do is to select the back of this, and let's make this, hmm, probably oak planks. Boom. That looks good. Oh, yeah. Look, it's perfectly centered. You like that? I know. I do like it. And now we can border it like this. Scratch the circle I was trying to make. This is so much better. Now, let's border this with stripped dark oak wood. And this will indicate to Square City that we need to refuge here inside the grocery store, which is a perfect place because we could survive here for years. Hold on. Let me go gather somebody. Who are you gathering, Shady? I'll bring them. Okay. All right. Now, the walls of the city were built, and that looks really good, actually. Now, we can start working on the actual insides of this place. And whoa, what do we got here? Hey, man, put me down, bro. Put me down. Wait, what? Shady? What are you doing? Man, what's going on? Clyde? Yeah, I brought Clyde in here. Yo, where's Juliet? Oh, gosh. Hey, man, where's my wife at? Oh, there she is. Juliet's right here, Clyde. <laughs> Hey, man. Square City's having another nuclear war zone going on. Yes, Clyde. Oh, man. All right, at least I'm with my baby. This is just great. Yeah, you know what? It's good that we have a couple here. Yeah, now they can do lovey-dovey stuff while the big, strong bros work. Yeah. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna get a piston right here. I'm gonna make a door to this place because we need to secure this place up. We're just gonna start like this. I'll place pistons on both sides, just like that. And we obviously gotta get a secure block, so let's go with obsidian. Perfect. Now let's place some blocks that go over the top, just like this. Let's get some redstone dust right here. And then after that, we can place a lever above it. And we can place that on the other side. Boom. Now whenever we flick it... Wait. Oh, gosh. Uh, I don't think it connects. Oh, it looks like I don't think pistons can push obsidian. So, you know, we're gonna change that to polished deep slate. Boom. Now whenever we flick the lever, it should release like this, and we can flick it back and forth. But that's not gonna be the only door we make, because obviously you can't have a door that directly leads into the outside world. If anyone that has radiation comes inside of here, then this whole bunker is gonna be cooked. So, you know what? We're gonna place dispensers right here, and we're gonna have a water cleaning area. And we're gonna go like this, and we're gonna get some dispensers. Let's put some dispensers on both sides of this thing, and then we want to make this pretty high. So let's go like this and place a roof to this thing. And then now let me put some water in each of these, just like this. Put that on all four sides. And then obviously we want some pressure plates right here so that whenever they walk through, they get splashed with water. Boom. And now we're going to place another door right here. And we could easily copy this door by selecting from here to here and then copying and then pasting. Boom. All right. Now let me close this off. And now no one that we don't want coming through, we can just close that door. Perfect. And now let me close off these walls real quick and we could just select over here and then set that to iron blocks. And let me build these walls even more. What are you guys working on over here? I'm just working on the walls. Whoa, this looks really cool, Zoe. Thank you. I'm gonna build these walls up a little bit. And wait, what is going on over here? Why is there a sign that says cash blocks? Wait, or cash box? Oh my gosh. Is cash okay in there? He's working on something, I think. Okay, got it. I'll let him cook. Hey, bro, let me chill in here. Okay, and you know what? Now that we built this area, Zoe, I kind of want to decorate it. Okay. So you know what? I'm gonna add a roof to this section. Let me make these walls pretty high up, though. So let's make these go all the way up to the roof. Zoe, can you help me expand real quick? Yeah, I got you. You gotta expand this whole entire area again. Oh gosh, I'd actually place it a piston door. Oopsies. All right, and the last wall is right there. Perfect. Now we have all the walls. Please let's make the interior of this thing. Looks like they were started to build something here. So you know what? Let's build that up a little bit. I'm pretty sure this will lead into our nuclear bunker. They want this looking really secure. So let's build each of these walls up just like this. Perfect. And we want to route this up on all sides, basically. So let's go like that. Go over here. Let's do the same. Just like this. Nice. And what do we got? Whoa, this is insane. Mia, are you building an armory? Yeah. Yes, I am. This is so cool. Okay, I'm gonna let you guys work down there while me and Zoe work up here. All right, the next thing is I'm gonna get some fences right here. And let's see, I want a cool fence. I think these black picket fences will work well. Actually, let, let me get a wall right here and let me get a cool wall. I think these deep slate tile walls will work pretty well right here. Let's place these along the side. These just will add an extra detail to this middle section, which will lead us to our main base. And honestly, I'm not sure what I'm building right here, but it's gonna look really cool. And ooh, I like the lava in the center here. I have an idea. What if I place the lava right here and I have that flow all the way down to the bottom? That way there's lava flowing into the middle. And then what I could do is I could get some glass panes right here. We gotta get the orange glass paint right here, and we could just build walls right here. And yeah, that is gonna look so much better. Let me just build all four sides just like this, and then we could connect all of them at the end. I could probably do a command that could do this a lot faster. So let's get a wand right here. Let's select on this corner, and then let's select all the way up here. And let's set the walls of that to orange stained glass panes. Perfect. And then now let's break all of the weird looking ones. A few of them are glitched. All we have to do is break it again to fix them. And there we go. Now it's fully fixed. Check that out. That looks so good in 
the middle. Okay, now all we have to do is place some walls on each of these edges. Make this look a lot better by adding some more detail. And then what I could do is I could get some stairs. And I can actually get netherite block stairs. Just like this. So we can also get netherite slabs too. So let's place these on the edges. Let's do that on each of these little sections. And this just adds more of an advanced detail here. And we can repeat this pattern on all four sides. Okay, that looks good for sure. All right, I'm pretty sure that these walls feel a little bit blank. So you know what? I'm gonna add some pillars in the corners. So let's select right here. Let's set another right pillar right here. Boom. And then let's do that on all four sides. So I'm gonna go over here. Then do the same. Just like that. And then I'm gonna go over here and set the third pillar. And then lastly, the fourth pillar. Now all I have to do is connect these pillars on the top. Just like this. And this one will be a little bit complicated because I have to go around. So I'm just gonna do this manually. I don't always have to use world data. I can just use my hands. Just like that. And then now on the corners of these, I'm gonna place another right slabs. Going like this. This will make this look a lot more uniform. So it looks natural. Okay. And then now that should look good. We wanna do the same thing on this side as well. And now we have that pattern repeated on all four sides. And check that out. That looks really good. Now, on the bottom, we could place some netherite stairs going across here. And I think I have a perfect idea of some details that would make this place fully polished up. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some lava right here. And just like the middle, I want to have some lava dripping down from the top. So, we could go right here. And, oh gosh, we probably want to place a back to this so it doesn't flow out. So, go at this place, place some lava right there. And then we could do the same. And place some lava right here. And then, well, before it reaches the bottom, I could break a little hole. And this might be a hazard, but you know what? It looks cool. So, it's fine. Place another one right here. Oh, gosh. I should probably place the blocks at the back real quick. And then now we just break the bottom right here and let's set one right here and then another one right here and then now we got to place the blocks on the back again and then one lava right there and then another lava right there and now that wall should be done let's repeat that pattern on these two walls one more lava right here one more lava right here and then now we need to break the bottom ones and lastly this wall right here which i'll place one right here another one right here lava black lava black all right now all four of these walls are complete and check this out this looks so much better when you walk in honestly this top part is pretty much complete you know what let's patch up any unnecessary holes and then check Check this out. Whoa! We got something really cool going on over here. Man, get me out of this box. Wait, what? What's going on? Wait, is Cash releasing himself for the box? Cash! Over here! Huh? Oh. Wait, what's going on over here? I don't know what happened. Whoa. What? Did you just get frozen in a box? Yeah. Okay, come down here. We're all building. Oh, cool. Okay, we're building down here. And you know what? We're building all this to survive the nuclear missile. Oh, this is goaded. So, we have a perfect spot for our armor right here, which will help us from the blast. But next, we need to create our food storage. I fixed this. Wait, what? Oh, that looks so much better. You like it? Yeah. I do. <laughs> so I'm gonna replace this wall right here and I'm gonna replace this with deep slate bricks. Or actually, I should probably do a different block. So maybe smooth quartz would look better. Just like that. Boom. Now this wall is separated from the other walls. So let me think. How should our food storage be cached? Well, you should have a big burger on here or something. Ooh! You know what? I am gonna build a big burger. Yeah. We can do that easy by doing some pixel art. But make it 3D. So, first we're gonna need to make some concrete. Okay, I'm making it 3D. Ah, uh, you better. Let's get some back concrete for the outline, and then we'll do the coloring afterwards. So, first, let's do the outline of this burger. We're gonna build the top of it right here. This burger will symbolize where all of our food is. So, we're gonna start off right here by building just like this. And then we want this burger to shape this way. So, this will be the top bun. And we're gonna build it out more on this side. And this is basically the outline for this burger bun. Okay, that looks good for the top. So, now we could go right here. We could start caving it in a little bit. And that looks good. And then now we wanna build the different layers of this burger. So, let's build the lettuce layer just like this. This will all come together once I add all the inner blocks. True beans. But right now, it looks kinda wonky because I'm only using black blocks. Hey, watch me cook down here. So, uh, what do you Building. I'm building the bottom bun. Oh, yeah. Wait, what? The bottom bun. Oh, I see what you mean by 3D. Yeah. I was building a pixel art. Nah, that is not 3D. You know what? I'm gonna copy you, and I'm gonna copy your design. Okay. So let me scratch what I was doing before. I got the goaded designs. I'm gonna help you build your bottom bun. Okay. But make sure it's hollow. We need to walk inside of it. I know, I know. Okay. Don't you think that's a little too tall? Actually, that's fine. Yeah, no. It'll be okay in the end. True. Okay, what's the first topping of this? Well... Lettuce. Yeah, we gotta have lettuce. So I'm gonna get some green chair terracotta and some green concrete just to spice it up a little bit make it lime okay we'll add some lime in there as well oh this looks so good actually wait lime terracotta and green concrete looks good true beans we don't want the green looking too green or, or else yeah it'll, it'll look fake yeah it'll look fake we don't want to look fake and you know what usually on burger buns there's some texture on that so i'm gonna add some texture by adding some buttons no don't do buttons ew well, what do you mean look it looks so good uh i guess so jungle buttons come on ah uh, fine you gotta see the vision there i see the vision all right and then the next topping we're gonna put is Cheese! So we could get orange right here. Actually, you know what? We probably want to get yellow because cheese is definitely more yellow than orange. So let's get all our terracotta. And cheese is really yellow. So you know what? We can make this texturized like that. We could just keep 
and this as well. Whoa, are you building the meat layer or the ketchup layer? This is ketchup or tomato, whichever one you prefer. Okay, well, usually the ketchup goes over the meat, so you know what? Next is gonna be the meat layer, and we're gonna make that brown. Yeah, I make it droop down a little. Yeah, we don't want to make the brown too brown, or else it's gonna look overcooked. We do not want that. Yeah, no, that would not be good. All right, let's just texturize this a little bit. Okay, we low key cooking. Nah, we cooking. Okay, the next layer we're gonna want to do. Do you put tomatoes on your burgers? I love tomatoes. Okay, well, we're gonna put tomatoes on the top. Oh yeah. And we're gonna do that out of wool. It looks kind of similar to the ketchup, but it's okay. You forgot the onions. Onions? Who eats onions with their burgers? What are you talking about? Nah, I'm an onion hater. What? Really bougie? I'm just joking. Onions are pretty good, but I don't prefer it. Okay, what about pickles? Nah. Nah. <laughs> what? Zoe, you like pickles? I love pickles. They're all right by themselves. I don't like them on a burger. Nah, I just bite into a pickle. I'm like, ooh, what is that? <laughs> I can't talk to these two anymore. Word. This is why you're not building the burger. This is a little too wide here. I gotta fix this. All right. I think you can finish the top of the burger bun cash. I got you. What should I build on the inside? I'm gonna build a little door on the bottom. We're gonna build all the chests for our food storage. I'm gonna put a door right here. We're gonna make this an acacia door. And for the interior of this burger, we should probably change the block. So let's get a bunch of the terracotta right here. And let's start building the interior for this thing. I'm gonna place the floor and I'm gonna make this regular terracotta. So we'll set it to terracotta. Why is someone placing pickles in here? <laughs> You know what, fine. You can place your pickles, Zoe, but you know what? You're gonna have to eat the pickles out of the burger. That's not me. I would gladly eat the pickles. Oh, nah. Okay, and the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna place a bunch of fridges here. That's a mouthful. And this is where all of our food is gonna be stored. All right, Zoe, do you wanna put all the salmon here? Ooh, okay. All right, you fill up the fridges because we're gonna need that in order to survive. And yeah, this bun definitely cooked. Yeah, I'm gonna fix it, though. What do you mean, fix it? Let me shape it. Okay, okay, shape it. Mia, how is the armory going? It looks sick. Yeah, no, this looks really cool. Okay, let me check outside real quick, okay, guys? Okay. All right, first we gotta open this door. Why is this door open? Oh, gosh, I did put the lever right here. Okay, you know what? Let's open this real quick. And oh, gosh, guys. Word. Square City has some explosions out here. Oh, no. Is it gone? Uh, no, Square City is not gone yet, but there's definitely signs of explosions out there. So, you know what? Oh, gosh, wait, I need to get cleaned. It could be nuclear. Okay, we're good. Guys, we need to continue building this place. I'm afraid the Square City we knew before is gonna be gone. Let me cook with my sesame seeds. Okay, sounds good. I'm thinking that we should change the floor of this place because there's too much deep slate down here. So, I'm gonna select on this corner. And I'm gonna go all the way over here. And I'm gonna select on this corner. And then now, I'm gonna replace the floor with spruce planks. Done. And wow, okay, that looks way more homey. Now, oh, this pathway's messed up. I need to fix this a little bit. Let's replace this with dark oak planks. Boom. And oh yeah, that looks so much better. Now we can connect this right here. And this is looking good. Okay, we have an armory. And how is the burger looking? Oh, much better now. There's pickle on the lettuce. <laughs> and there's a lot of pickles. Yummy. No. Look at my sesame seeds. I noticed, guys. I haven't seen that someone in a while. Shaggy? Yeah, where's Shady? I don't know. Clyde, you know where he went? Oh, man, I don't know where he at. Oh, gosh. Uh, nah, he's trying to go stop the bomb himself. You think Shady's out there? Probably. No, no, we need to make sure he's okay. I'm gonna go outside real quick. Huh, all right. Refuge here at the nuclear center. Shady, what are you doing? What? I'm trying to let Square City know that we got a refugee center. Oh, that's good. You know what? We need to make this place more obvious. Isn't it obvious enough? It's got beacons coming out of it and a big nuclear sign. I think I know what we need to do. Let's get some black concrete and let's get some yellow concrete and let's outline this thing. Okay, I like that. Like a pattern. Okay, and you know what? I think we should start off right here. Let's go like this and do it every two. Do I hear bobs going off? Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Shady, can you me outline this thing? Yeah, I'm helping you. Do what I'm doing right now. Swap every two. Okay, Madden. Okay, and that looks good. Check this out. Oh, yeah, that definitely outlines this thing. Wait. Oh, yeah, Shady, you got the strat right here. Oh, yes, sir, Ski. I'll fill in the black concrete and you do the yellow. Bet. I'll do all these right here. Boom. Perfect. And this right here. Shady, I think you messed up a little bit. No way. Yeah, you messed up on a segment. Oh, gosh. Bruh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Nah, what is that? Oh, no. Nah, what's going on? What is going on, bro? This is why you don't do the strat. You mess up. No, it's fine. We're good, bro. We're good. Okay, we're good. Oh. Oh, no. What did you do? No, no I didn't do anything. Okay, there we go. Perfect. What did you do? <laughs> yeah, that that works, bruh. No, 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 no. No. You bloody. Uh, okay. You know what? Sure. Yeah, we'll call it that. I like that. Okay, that looks a lot better. Okay, Shady, we gotta head inside. Things are exploding. Let's go. You right. Uh, Cash, what you doing out here? Nah, bro trying to fix it. Bro's fix it? Oh, that looks a lot better. I mean, there's three pieces, bro. <laughs> okay. What is going on, man? Let's get inside, guys. Come on. What is going- Oh, no. Oh! Get down, get down. Ow! Oh! Everyone inside! Wait, my inventory got cleared. Uh-oh. Nah, mine did too. And I'm in survival. Good. Everyone armor up! Bro, there's a hole in the ceiling. Oh, great. Oh, we gotta go. Uh, 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 uh. Mia, what happened to your armor? It got exploded. Wait, seriously? You're kidding me, right? It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I worked so hard and for what? I got everything. Everyone eating and chanting going to an apple. Oh, gosh, okay. We need to bunker up in the burger. 
Yeah. Mia, I like gold, but I don't know if this is protecting me. No, that's why I put Procton. I put Procton. <laughs> I think I'm going to die today, guys. It was nice knowing you. Oh, no. Guys, we got to be careful. Everyone huddle up. All right. I have an idea. <laughs> Shady, what are you doing? How is this helping? All right, we're safe. Shady, I don't know how the yellow and black concrete saved us. How did the get down? Ah! No, not inside the burger pot. Oh, guys, oh, guys, oh, guys, oh, guys, oh, guys. Guys, the side of our doomsday bunker is leaking. Look, it's open. Oh, no. What do I hear out there? Oh, we're so dead. Look from above. There is an airstrike. What? Ah! No, no, no. Get under the stairs. Get under the stairs. Take cover. Why didn't y'all tell me I was muted? What do you mean? Nothing. That's crazy. Oh, nah. I had no idea bro was muted. Oh, nah. I can't believe I'm gonna die with a pickle in my inventory. Oh, no. The lava's coming down. No. Guys, should we all just escape this doomsday bunker? Yeah, I'm running. I'm gonna go see if I can live. Okay, let's go. Wow, these stairs are really inconvenient. Yeah, no, these stairs are not good. Oh, and they're broken. Should have built elevators. Yeah. Whose idea was it to build them? Oh, gosh. I fell off. Who took 10 minutes building those stairs? Me. Okay. Let me just get out of here. Ow! Oh! Guys, look at this thing from the outside. Dude, Square City is gone. Airstrike inbound. Everybody get down. Oh, no. Do you see that? And we're dead. It's over. Square City. No. Okay, maybe it's just that. Maybe we can survive after this. Oh, oh, oh. It's not stopping. It's not stopping. Oh, my gosh. Yo, they're dropping nonstop nukes. Uh-oh. Yo, our bunker is good. Holy smokes. Oh. At least Mia's armory saved us. Tell me why bro put the most protective layer on top. Okay, you know what? I did not think about that. Wow, this rain is really coming down. You know what? I need food. I need to get to the grocery store. What? Closed. The grocery store is never closed, even on rainy days. Let me see what's going on here. And it's closed from this entrance. Too? Wait a second. Hey, Juliet! How did he go? I can barely hear you. It's kind of muffled. Do you mind if I break this glass? Of course. What's going on? Why are you closing down the grocery store when you're literally inside here? You didn't hear? Hear what? There's a crazy storm coming. I have to stay inside. A crazy storm? Yes, he's supposed to kill everything. I had to close the whole store. Oh, gosh. What do you think I should do? You gotta get out of here, Nico. It's gonna tear down this whole place. Okay, well, let me get my friends. Thank you, Juliet. No, no, no. Don't get your well, what do you mean? Well, they're gonna steal all your food. We're gonna be stuck inside for days. Wait, so were you saying that I shouldn't trust my friends? I wouldn't trust anybody. You know what? You're right. Survival the fittest. It is. I'm the fittest. I get the whole grocery store. Okay, Juliet, you know what? I need to buckle down. I'm headed home. And Martin? Hey, Nico, it's about to start raining in a couple minutes for you. Well, it's already raining. It's really coming down here. I know, right? You'll start to feel it pretty soon. Okay, I need to get back to my house. I'll see you later, Martin. Just watch out. It's about a storm. I'm telling you ahead of time, because you're, you know, you're short. Well, I can feel the rain on me, Martin. It's already raining. You'll feel it in a second. Oh, my gosh. I need to get in my house now. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. I kill it so we see me. <laughs> You. Wait, Shady's looking at me as well. Oh, gosh. Uh, I see you over there, bro. Uh, no, you don't. Hey, Nico, you going inside? What? Where's Cash? I'm on my roof. Wait, I can't see. Ow! I just got struck by lightning. You going in there? Yeah, I'm going in there, but don't follow me. I'll see you guys later. Ow. Gosh, this lightning is crazy. I can't trust any of my friends, even Cash. Uh, I'm gonna try and steal my food. It is survival of the fittest out here. And, wait, what is this? I was gonna build a bunker down here, but there's already something here. But when did this get here? Uh, what? Bearded miner? Bunker you put this inside of here? Oh my gosh, what is this? I was gonna build a doomsday bunker down here, but there's already something here. What did this get here? Did you just say a hundred years ago? This has been here the entire time and I didn't know? Where did you get this? And yeah, this thing does look run down. Why was this near my base? You know what? I don't know, but this definitely looks doomsday bunkery. Is that even a word? Okay, you don't understand me. Where's the other Oh, he's down there. Okay. So, Spider, you went here? And whoa. This place looks good, but this is so run down. If I'm going to use this place, this place definitely needs some renovations. Yeah. Mustache Biter! Well, nice to see you, Mustache Biter. What pickaxe are you holding? That thing looks so shiny. All right, Toe Spider's here too. You know what, guys? I have an idea. I'm going to renovate this and I'm going to use this to survive the storm that's coming up. But you guys cannot not tell my friends, okay? Uh, Promise me? Look at me. Uh, I'm looking at you, Toast Butter. You have a big mouth. Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna need a creative key. Does any of you have a creative key? <laughs> cookie? <laughs> I've got no cookie. 
cookies. Cookies. Nobody gave you a cookie when I get in creative mode. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I don't understand. What is that? Blah, blah. Is that a creative god? Oh, it, what? I'm in creative mode. Blah, blah, cookie. Okay, fine. I'll give you a cookie. Here, just take it. Cookie. Cookie. What's your name? Oh, my gosh. Uh, you guys are crazy. <laughs> okay, mustache spider, how long does this last for? <laughs> you said 20 minutes? Oh, gosh. I need to build this fast. <laughs> well, you guys can help me if you want. You don't have to help me, but you know what? I need to remove all these cobwebs and everything. We definitely need to renovate this place and speed this up. So, everyone, focus on mining all the cobwebs and getting rid of this stuff. And why is there a random sign here? Okay, you know what? I could probably do this faster with commands, right? <laughs> okay, so let's do it. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select all the blocks we don't want in here. Like, coarse dirt cobwebs, and obviously the water. So then we can do a command, replace near. We can replace near and select all those blocks and set that to air. And yeah, that removes a lot of stuff. And we can just do that in all of these rooms. So let's do this. Boom! Get rid of all that stuff. And if we go into this room, get rid of all of that stuff. And we want to basically clear all of these rooms. We're going to decide what we're going to build at each of these rooms later. But we just have to remodel this place because this place does not look bushiful. We need this place to look at spick and span in order for us to build in here. And yeah, let's remove all these leaves. And the entrance to this place is right over here. So we're going gonna have to make this more secure. And before I do anything, I need to place a security door on my main door right here so that my friends do not bother me. Iron door right there. No one is gonna invade this house. No one is gonna steal my food as well. I'm keeping all my goodies to myself. Now I'm gonna replace all of this mossy cobblestone and regular cobblestone with stone. I might replace these blocks a little bit later, but we definitely need to remodel this place as a whole. This is not looking up to par. And I think the actual block we need to do for this floor is cobblestone. So let's just redo that. Let's replace this entire floor with cobblestone. All right, there we go. And then now we need to patch up all these holes. And why is there a big hole right here? Let's get rid of that. Let's set this all to smooth stone. Fortunately, we have commands. If we didn't have commands, this would be a lot more difficult. Okay, the doubt here, we need to fix these sides right here. Just like this. So let's set that side to cobblestone. And then this side to cobblestone as well. Also, miners, if you're in this bunker still, make sure you're renovating this place. <laughs> we need all these walls spick and span. We cannot have no mossy anymore. I don't know how this place was underneath my house this entire time. But you know what? This is quite convenient for there being a storm going on right now. If this storm destroys my entire house, then I have this as backup. All right, I think I'm gonna replace all of the mossy cobblestone with smooth stone just like this. Boom. And then now I'll replace all the walls. And this room is looking a lot better. Look at this. This looks so much cleaner than before. Now if we go to this main room over here, yeah, we definitely need to repair all these walls. We need to make sure that these walls are intact. So let's remove all of the mossy cobblestone. And I think I can also replace all of that stuff with smooth stone. Boom. And then we'll fix it a little bit later. It's time to patch up all these walls and make this look a lot better. So let's do this room now. All right. And this room is now done. That is looking a lot better. Time to do the same process with these other rooms. And it's just a bunch of placing up these pillars and making sure that everything's uniform. Once this is all good, we can start working on these individual rooms and modifying this place. Changing the blocks and everything. So let's get to it. Another room fully completed. This is looking a whole lot better. The floor of garden looking good. We just need to fix this main area. And there's only a few rooms left we need to do. Alright, that room looks good. The very last room is over here. And there's only a few fixes we need to do in these rooms. And we are done. All of these rooms are fully remodeled. Check it out. Look how clean this place looks. There's a little fixes here and there, but you know what? We are now completed with the remodeling. So, it is time to change up each of these rooms. And first, let's start off with the entrance and go to the very end. So, I want to change up this area real quick. And let's first select over here and then select all the way over here. I think I want to change the floor of this place to a different block. So, let's replace all the cobblestone with black concrete. Boom! That looks a lot better. And now, let's finish this border real quick by making it black and yellow. And that looks good. And then, we need to replace these walls. So, let's get all the smooth stone. And let's think, what's a good block to make the walls? I'm thinking a more secure block than just smooth stones. So, I'm thinking we could replace the walls with quartz. So, let's get some smooth quartz up in here. Oh, yeah. That is definitely an upgrade to this place. This makes the walls look so much better. And you know what? We could replace, honestly, all the smooth stone with smooth quartz in this place. So, let's do that with a simple command. Let's just go around this place and select all the walls and do a command like this and throughout here. And now, every single wall in this place is now smooth quartz. But, we could replace the other blocks as well. So, let's keep on doing this. Next up is these cobblestone stairs. And we can pull replace it with black concrete stairs. So I want to replace all the cobblestone with black concrete. All right, and that's all the cobblestone replaced. Look at that. We have black concrete for some of the walls now, which looks good. And then now for this cobblestone stairs, we're going to get the black concrete stairs just like that. And that honestly looks really good. Okay, and then these andesite walls right here, we can honestly replace these with some yellow concrete. Just like that. We need to get this whole area selected. So let's do that. And now that all these stairs are yellow, so we just need to replace a few more blocks. Polished andesite, stone bricks, and all these other blocks. I think we replace the polished andesite with yellow concrete as well. There we go. All of that's yellow concrete. And then now these stone bricks. Actually, let's replace the andesite, polished andesite with gray concrete. And that looks better. Then we can replace the stone bricks with this gray concrete as well. Boom. And then lastly, the andesite.
it, which I'm thinking we make that yellow concrete. Just like that. And the only thing to change is the light gray concrete on the roof, which I think we'll just make that black concrete. Done! And that is looking like a lot better of a color scheme. Okay, before we build out the rooms, let's go back to the start. Now that we've remodeled this entire place, we could actually start building the interiors of this stuff. So, I'm thinking we should place the security code at the front, because we need to make this place super secure. So, let's obviously add a code door. I'm thinking we place no traditional door here. I'm thinking we place a piston door. So, let's get some sticky pistons, and let's place that on both sides. Then, after that, we could connect that to some redstone, and we can make this pretty simple. Place some redstone right here, then a block right here, and then place a redstone torch right here. Then, all I have to do is connect those two. So, let's get a redstone repeater, and then connect them at the bottom. And connect the redstone repeater right here. Connect this redstone dust underneath, like this. And then, now, we can place a lever right around here, and then connect another smooth slab right there, and then connect this over. Now that we flick the lever, it should go like this, but the bottom two don't go, so we're just gonna make those bottom two slabs. Or actually, we can make them stairs, so you can still walk through it, even if they don't work. And we could go like this, and whenever we flick it, it looks like this. Whenever you flick it out, it goes like that. All right, that works. Okay, now, what we're gonna want for this place is we're gonna want some lava right here. We're gonna want this super secure, so let's set this to lava, just like so. Let's replace all this stone on the sides with black concrete. There we go, that just looks more sleek. And in order to get to the other side, we're gonna place some invisible barriers. And obviously, we could just place this going across, and we could add a few twists and turns right here. This is just gonna make it harder for anyone to get through. I do not want my friends fighting my secret base. And then over here, we're gonna make another difficult part. So we're gonna dig down just like so. And oh, this place is all hollow. What the heck? Let me set the walls of this bottom part right here to black concrete. And then set the floors out of black concrete. But on this floor, we're gonna place dripstone. So just another security measure. And we're gonna wanna place this dripstone all on the floor. Make sure there's no gaps at all. All right. And then we can make some of them taller than the others. Just make sure it looks cool. Okay, boom. Now that looks deadly. Let's place back this floor. And then now, in order to get to the other side, you're gonna have to do some minecart parkour. So, if you don't know what minecart parkour is, you can get a rail and a minecart, and then place two black concrete slabs on the side of this thing and a minecart. I probably want to make this yellow just so it could stand out more. We want to get these concrete slabs on the left and right. And then now, in order to beat this, all you have to do is jump and make a leap of faith and do the minecart parkour, which is quite difficult. And we can make the last one over here and then break it. Okay, nice. Now, you're gonna have to do these two difficult minecart jumps in order to make it to the other side. And you just blip up when you reach the end, which is quite good. So, it's gonna look like this. Boop, perfect. And that is just another security measure. The very last security measure before we build our base is gonna be right here inside this hallway. And I know this is a perfect hallway to make a TNT fall trap. But you can still get across legitly. So, first, what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to get rid of the floor. And we're just gonna do that and go pretty far down. And we're gonna set that to air. And then we need to make the walls out of obsidian. The reason why I'm making it out of obsidian is because the, we're gonna have some TNT in here. We cannot have this TNT exploding the entire base. So, let's set the all to obsidian, and let's even set the floor to obsidian. Then on the bottom, what we're going to need to do is we're going to have to set multiple layers of water. I think four works pretty well, so let's do that. And then we're going to need to place the bottom layer is going to be TNT. The second layer being sand, and the third layer being pressure blades. And obviously, we don't want to do this at the start because we might accidentally blow up our base. Worst case scenario. So, we're going to have to do this later. But you can run across this legitly. So, we could just set this all to stone pressure plates. Boom! Okay, perfect. That is the very last security defense, and now we enter the base. Time for the fun part, modeling this entire area. So, this first room is gonna be relatively simple. I think in this main room, we wanna make this the main living room. So, we're gonna make a couch over here. We're gonna build a sofa. We're gonna go like this, and we're gonna start off in the middle, and we're gonna make the sofa blue, and then we're gonna make a pretty big TV over here. And actually, we can get some TVs inside creative mode. And there's some OLED TVs right here, which is pretty nice. So, let's get some slabs and place that along the walls. All right, and imagine watching TV on eight TV screens. That's what we're gonna do. All right, that looks good. And then now, we wanna place another layer of TV screens right here. And there is so much entertainment right here, you do not know what to do with it. Check out all that entertainment. Next, we're gonna place a carpet right here. A cyan carpet. Just to make this look a little bit more homey. And go like this. And just to fill up some of the dead space, we're gonna place some oak logs in the corner with some leaves on top. These are gonna act as little plants. And we could go like this and place this on all two sides. All right, that is looking a whole lot better. And yeah, that did fill up the empty space. I do not think this is exactly centered, so you know what? We're gonna add another block on both sides real quick. And we're just gonna shift these TVs over a little bit. There we go. Now that is centered. Perfect. All right, now time for this room over here. And I think I know exactly what to build for this room. This room is gonna be a little bit more secure, so we're gonna wanna make the floor of this place more menacing. So let's set that to netherite blocks. Boom. These are the most difficult blocks to get in Minecraft, but we're just building the floor out of this because we're in creative mode, so might as well. We're gonna make little armory pods in here because you never know when you need armory inside a secret base. If my friends pull up out here, I need to figure out a way to defeat them. So let's get some dispensers right here. Let's place a little pod over here, just like this. And this will be one armory station, so we're gonna set all the armor inside of this thing. And we can place whatever armor we want. Let's see, what's the cool armor set that we could do? Whoa, there are some sick armor sets. And look at this Windwalker set. Look at this! Uh, whoa, 
Oh, this looks so cool. You know what? I could probably get a Windwalker sword, too. Oh, yeah, I can. Look at this thing. Oh, yeah, we're doing all this. And we're gonna put some fancy enchants on this thing. We're gonna put protection five on all the armor sets. So let's do that. Then we're gonna put sharpness on this sword. Okay, boom. And then now let's fill in all these chests. Let's start off with the helmet right here, the chest plate, the leggings, the boots, and then go into the sword. I feel like we definitely need some other things. So let's get some golden apples in here. And then let's see what our options for shields are. Ooh, look at this shield of the deep. That's gonna fill well with my armor set. And we're gonna put protection five on that one as well. All right, now if I clear my inventory real quick and I get a fence and a pressure plate, check it out. Whenever I go inside, I get fully fitted up with all this armor. And I even got the shield of the deep right here, which looks pretty good with this armor set. All right, now all I have to do is copy this armory station. We're gonna title this armory station. And we can simply add some ink sacks right here. So let's add a black dye and glowing sack. And that looks good. And then now we can select this armory station. Let's go behind it, select that. And now we can copy and paste this a bunch of time across the room. All right, we're gonna wanna put some on this side as well. So we're gonna wanna rotate it and then paste it again. And that is all the armory stations. Look at all that. And let me take some of this armor off. It's giving me a weird effect. Now, the last thing I could do in this room right here is I could get some yellow concrete slabs and let's just place that over all this. I think that would add a cool design to this place. All right, and that looks good. Now, we have two more rooms left. And I know just the purpose of this room. This room is gonna be our escape pod. In case we ever need to get out of this place, we're gonna simply escape through here. So, let's build out just like this. And we're gonna make this go all the way to the surface. So, let's build. I'm gonna go all the way to the surface with this thing and we're gonna set that to air. And then we're gonna set the walls of that to gray concrete. Boom. And then now, if we go all the way down, and we place it just like this, we will have access to the roof here. And we want to place some ladders here. We're going to make this a very simple escape. And it's going to go like this up here. And then we want to make this hatch pretty secretive. So we're going to go like this. And then place a hidden trapdoor right here. Boop. And then now you can just open this trapdoor whenever we want to get out. And that was looking really good. Now we have an escape to go to the surface whenever we want. And I'm pretty sure that ends up in the forest. But this room is looking off a lot empty. So you know what? We might as well just place a little pool in here. We can't get it off of a pool, right? A pool underground would be sick. So that's why I'm building it. Set the walls of that to smooth quartz. And set the floor to smooth quartz. And then now we can set all this to water. Boom, that's our pool done. All right, now we have a pool, an armory, a living room. And now time for the last room. I think, you know what? Each of these sections is gonna be a little bedroom. So let's first build not my bedroom right here. Let's place the floor with spruce planks. Then I wanna build out a fridge, a kitchen counter, just like this. This and I want to place a sink right here and then some kitchen drawers and let's place the kitchen drawers up here And then we want to add some more design So let's get some spruce logs and place these along over here What I want to do is I want to add a little bunk bed for myself So on my beds right here get some slabs and then place more beds up here in case I want to sleep on the bottom or the top and then lastly we want to get some carpets And we want to make this gray carpets and that looks good now We can copy this over so let's get a wand right here Let's select on the bottom and on the top Let's copy this and now we can just paste this on all sides so let's do that Paste, paste, and then we can flip it and then paste it again on all these sides. That is looking good. And now, obviously, we want to replace the beds because in case things do work out and my friends do come here, you know, I want them to be able to sleep in these beds. So first, we want a bed for Cash over here, then a bed for Shady. Obviously, a bed for Mia. Actually, wait, I still need to place the Zoe better here. Let me redo that. All right, and then lastly, a bed for Mebo. Check that out. We have a bed for each and every one of my friends and even amenities as well. The bunker is now done. This is looking quite beautiful. I hope everything's okay out there. I'm just gonna take a peek and look. All right, now I can open up this. And wait, what happened to my items? And wait, I'm in survival? Oh, gosh. Uh, oh, gosh, I lost my creative. Oh, no. Is it okay out there? Oh, guys. What do I say, my friends? Bro, we're stuck out here. Hey, good luck, guys. Yo, let us in there, bro. Hey, yo. Ooh, perfect. Oh, gosh. Hi, Nico. It's probably really loud out there. Are you sure it's okay? It's terrible out there. Well, good luck, guys. Wait, where are you going? I'm following him. Oh, gosh. Uh, no, you're not hiding in my base. Uh, hey, what is Hey, let me through. Yo, let us in, bro. How did you just face through that? Okay, fine. You guys can be let in. Yeah. But you guys will not get through my maze. I'm just gonna follow you. Wait, I just realized you can walk through the middle and then beat the whole thing. Oh, no. <laughs> I did not lock in. Uh, oh. oh, no. You did not get the strats. Yeah. Okay, me and Cash got the strats. All right, oh, ow, 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 ow. Nah, bro fell in. Bro, <clears throat> ain't no way I fell into my own thing. All right, there we go. Let's go. All right, can Mia do it? Let's see. Mia, you got this? Ow, oh, she did it. Yeah. Okay, what about this? Only a few of us can finish this at a time, so sure. sure. I'll see y'all later. Yeah, see y'all later, guys. I'm so bad. Days. Yo, whatever. I'll be able to catch up to us. Hey, have fun back there. And yeah, it looks like the TNT is exploding quite well down there. Nah. Come on, come on. Oh. I made it. Oh, gosh. Well, you know what? Since you guys entered my bunker, you guys are not ready. I'm gonna attack you. Oh, no. We're gonna get you. We got armor, too, dude. Oh, perfect. 
Oh, no, why did I not think of that? Booyah. Attack time. Why am I missing a helmet? Why is there no helmet? Uh, yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, I'm just gonna steal it from Nico's. Hey! Boom, gang. Get him anyway. Hey, guys, relax. Hey, yo, let him get up. Let him get up. Let him get up. Why do you want to kill us anyways? Because you guys are gonna steal all my food. What? Huh? Why would we do that? What, the Martin? To survive in the doomsday? We brought our own food. Yeah, dude, I got cookies. No, are you serious? So I built this by myself for nothing? You could have had us help you. We just watched you build this whole thing for us. Oh, my gosh. Well, come over here, guys. I built bunk beds for you. Wait, really? And I even built one for Amiibo. <gasps> He's going to love that. So, I guess we're gonna have to survive the storm together. Wow, just like family. Well, yeah. Cash, uh, what you doing today? It's time to play! Psst, Nico. Cash, hello. Psst, I'm not in my house. What? Uh, Look at the trap door on the floor. Wait, what? What are you doing down there? Get down here, open it. What are you doing? I'm hiding. From what? Uh, From the aliens. I saw one in the city. What? Cash, there are no aliens. Uh, okay, well then suit yourself and go find out. Did you watch the news or something? Yeah, I even saw one with my own eyes. Wait, you have the news playing right here. Attention, Square City. Please take imminent shelter. Imminent shelter for what? Are you gonna say it? There is an alien invasion coming towards Square City, and they are launching a nuclear attack on our city. Please take shelter immediately. Oh gosh, maybe he is telling the truth. The news usually doesn't lie. Cash, you were right. Then hide. Are you underneath your bed? Yes. How are you doing that? I'm hiding underneath it. <laughs> Wait, what do I hear? Oh, gosh. Uh, it's fine. We're in your bunker, right? You see that thing? Hello. Oh, gosh. I am going to kill you. What? <laughs> Cash! Cash, we gotta get out of here! No, don't get me involved in this. Ow! He's attacking you. Ow! <laughs> he found us, Cash. He found us. He found you. Oh, no! I'm running! Bea! Guys, I messed up. Well, what? I may have caused some problems. Problems? What do you mean? I started some problems with some aliens, and now they're going to attack us. What? Uh, yeah. I'm behind you. Oh, see right there, right there! Oh, gosh! Mia, Mia, we gotta go! Yeah, this is my fault. I'm sorry! <laughs> Just run! I don't know what Cash and Shady are, but I hope they find us. Oh, we gotta get some shelter quick. We might have to get out of Square City. Guys, follow me. I have an idea. Okay. We're just gonna have to run all the way over there. So keep running. Wait, can you carry me? No, I'm not gonna carry you. I don't wanna run the... Ow! Okay, I'm gonna start running. I'm gonna start running! <sighs> Guys, we have to lose them. Come on. <sighs> Okay, I think we might have lost them. Okay, I think we're safe here. Yeah, but can you call Cash and Shady? Yeah, let me text him. We need to connect with them. He's more of a texter. What? No, this is an emergency, Mia. We need to call them. Meet us here, smiley face. <laughs> ah! Keep on running! Wait, Shady? Yo. Did you just kill that guy? Yeah, he's dead. Wait. It's over. We're safe. No, there's more coming. We should keep running. Wait, what? Ow! Ow! All right, go, go, go! Yo, he's trying to stick his tongue on us. Shady, do you have a car or something? We might need to get out of Square City. No, but I have this. All right. Well, that should be good against a few of them. Let's steal a van from Juliet's house or like a truck. All right, let's go. There might be one behind the barn. Everyone hop in. Wait, what? Oh, he's got a truck. Go, go, go! Hop in the back! Let's go! Man, you're gonna have to get in there. There we go. Get in the trunk. We gotta go, go. So we off my head. Oh, sorry. No, no. That alien is really trying to get us. Uh. Yeah, what I tell you? Yo, let me get an angle on him. Drive to the left. I'm driving to the left. <laughs> Mia, how did you even anger these aliens? You're missing, bro. I said a yo mama joke to them. Oh, no. And now they want to take over Square City? Yeah, that's on me. I started some beef. Those haven't been funny since 2017. Bro, I'm bringing them back. Okay, well, let's go. We're going to need to find a flat land. Yo, keep driving. I'm going. All right, how does this look? I think we got away from them. Okay, guys, they might know where our location. I think they're smarter than humans. I'm not going to lie. That's true. We should probably get rid of any evidence. Yeah, that's a good idea, actually. Now we have no truck. We're going to need to survive a long time here. So that maybe when these aliens are gone, we could go back to Square City. Yeah, I hope they don't. Oh. Shh, shh, shh. Get down. What? We're being watched. Wait, what? Get down. Well, what do you mean, get down? Sorry, sorry, get down. Scared. Oh. Shady. Shh. Shh, 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 shh. Don't say a word. He's just gonna pass by, okay? We stand very still. <laughs> Oh, gosh. I don't think he sees us. He's going away. Oh, my gosh. Guys, I told you. They know where we are. I don't think no matter how far we go, we're going to get rid of them. So we need to go underground. Yeah, that was terrifying. Mia, do you have creative keys? I do. All right, give them to us. Shh, stay low. Wait, what? No, 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 not again. <gasps> Guys. Okay, here you go. Oh, let's go. I'm in creative mode. Get down, get down, get down. Wait, what do you mean? What? Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, gosh. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Yo! Yo, that thing just ate Zoe. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, Shady, you should have done that earlier. Guys, we need to build the base fast. Okay. And you know what? Hmm. Oh, gosh. That thing is still there. <laughs> Wait, where did it just go? I think it just teleported and took Zoe. Nico, we gotta build! We gotta build! Okay, let's go! Let's start building. First, we're gonna make a hallway right here. This is gonna enter our underground bunker. We're gonna make this a long hallway. Okay. Bro switched into build mode. Guys, we're gonna need to build a new civilization down here, okay? Sounds like a plan. So we're gonna need everything. All necessities. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change the walls of this thing right here. Let's go like this. And then let's replace these walls with polished deep slate. Boom. And now that looks industrial. Okay, I'm pretty sure that I don't think the aliens will see this because they couldn't see us laying on the floor. But just in case, I'm gonna break some blocks and then get some ghost blocks right here. And then we're gonna make this camouflage into the wall. Oh. Oh, very bouge. So we're gonna go like this. We're gonna make it look like it's a part of the mountain. Wait, where's the base? What do you mean? Where did you build it? Yeah, the base is right here. How did you forget? Oh, you covered it up. Okay, and we got our snipers here watching. We got Shady on deck and... Hey, yo, Cash is not on deck! What do you mean? I'm resting. Okay, he's getting his beauty sleep. All right, fine. I'll go work in here. All right, good. All right, we're gonna go right here and we're gonna go right... Oh, no. Guys, what is that? There's a thing in there. Uh... Um, what the bouge? Okay, you know what? We're gonna need to make a security lock to this thing. Shady! Shady, I thought you were on deck! How to get in. I thought you were on deck, Shady! Okay, I think we're good. Nico, let me handle the isolation chamber. What's the isolation chamber? You'll see. I'm gonna build it, and it's gonna scan to make sure you're a human. Oh, okay. Well, I'll let you handle with that. All right. I think I'm gonna make a security door right here as well. Do it. So we'll go like this, and we're gonna break down just a little bit. And this is going to be a sand door, Mia. You know what a sand door is? You and your sand doors, bro. What do you mean? I haven't even made that many sand doors in my lifetime. Bro loves the sand. There's an army! Wait, what? Nah, he's fighting people. Wait. Oh! There was a lot of aliens out there already. Yeah, I caused a lot of problems. All right. First, we're going to get some repeaters right here. Mia, I can't believe you did it. said a your mama joke to them. Dude, I'm bringing them back, and you know it. Please don't. Come on! Oh, gosh. Okay, we're going to go with the lever right here, just like this. What am I hearing outside? And then we're going to get some sand powder, and we're going to make this very industrial. We're going to make a little industrial design right here. All right, now I got to place the yellow concrete powder just like this. So whenever you flick this lever, boom, watch this. And now we have the door open up. All right. Do you like that design? No, you can only use it once, I think. No, 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 no. I have the reset method. Give me a second. It's gonna be usable only three times. Got it? Brody said three times. Guys, I heard slander, but I died. Wait, where did you go? Oh, you've been dead for a while, huh? Yeah. So you're back! Yeah, I got some broken bones. Oh, gosh. Um, what is that? What is outside? Oh, no. I'm building this door right now, so give me a second. Ew! All right, if we go like this, and then we place this design. We have to place this multiple times. So we're gonna place it one time right here. Ooh, why'd you use this block? What do you mean? We have to use concrete powder. Ew. So that it falls, Zoe, you know? Now whenever we flick that lever, it opens the door. But we don't want to flick it just yet, Mia, because then... Can I press it? Okay, Zoe, fine, you can press it. But you said I couldn't. Yay! You're gonna have to rebuild it. Oh, no, I'm good. Are you serious? <laughs> You said I could. You literally got played. Oh, my gosh. All right. Now it's time to go down. And I, I keep hearing Shady outside, so... Get down! Well, I just heard my ice maker. We're gonna make this a deep underground bunker. I want an ice maker. Ice maker? We don't have no ice maker inside our bunker, Mia. Oh, we will. But that is a good suggestion. I just heard the cat food bowl go off. One sec. Oh, no, wait. Wait, is it... Oh, yep, it's 12. Wait, what? The cat food bowl. Wait, you wouldn't understand, Nico. You're not hip. Hey, Shady! Shady, what have them got through? What? Yo, kill it! What is that? Mia, you gotta kill it! Good job, Nico! Way to put in that good work. All right, now for this part, we're gonna make these walls out of netherite blocks. And I really like the look of the netherite blocks. They look so good. And then now we're gonna place some trap doors here. And this is where our actual bunker will lead into. Ow. Now I can place pressure plates on all sides. Zoe. Hey, how am I gonna... Oh, okay, there we go. Zoe, did you get claustrophobic or something? Yeah, I didn't like that. She's afraid of Santa Claus. All right, now if we go in this direction right here, just like this, we can start building the actual base. Let's place water right here so that... Okay, but how are you gonna get back up. Zoe, you think we're gonna get back up? Yeah. We're building a civilization down here. What if we had to go back home to get, like, the milk? Okay, we'll build an escape method after this, okay? Okay. I'm gonna build a very long hallway right here, and we're gonna build multiple rooms, guys. Okay, little bows. Underground, we need all the survival necessities. We need entertainment, food, water, shelter, everything like that. Hold on, dibs on entertainment. Me, I'm doing entertainment! No, 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 please, please, I have a good one. Okay, can I do it with you? Uh, okay, but here, I'll tell you what it is beforehand. It's Nico's boogie-woogie room. No, me, we're not doing that. Come on! 
on, dude. All right, Cash, when you're done out there, you can come down here. We're building multiple rooms right here. So we're going to build one room on this side and then one room on this side. Okay, boogie. And then more rooms on this side over here. So we have four rooms. This is a very dim hallway. And then all the way over here, we're going to make this the escape method. But we'll work on that later. All right, Mia, I'm going to add some color right here. Don't worry. I'm adding some yellow and black concrete around these things like this. This sort of looks like caution tape. It does. You're right, Nico. That's good. Good job, Nico. Yeah. Why is me always doing this to me? <laughs> I did nothing. I'm just building. It's too easy. I want to talk about it. Anywho, let's continue. He's a little boogie woogie. All right. Once we do this pattern and we copy this over and all this stuff, I think I want to change the floor as well. This polished deep slate is getting very redundant. So we're just going to select right here and over here. We should change this to a lighter block. So let's do quartz block. Oh, yes. Uh, this is looking good. And yeah, I'm not going to lie. This hallway is quite thin. But you know what? It's all good. Zoe, what are you doing right here? I'm making the food place. Zoe, add a purple. Yeah, purple's nice. Oh, my gosh. Okay, Mia, while you work on the entertainment room, I'll come back to this. I am so excited. I am going to build the sleeping and lodging. Not the sleeping and lodging. You know what lodging is? What, Nico? That is where you stay at a place overnight. Really? I think so. No way. You're kidding. You're kidding. And this place needs to be quite cozy. So let's make this four spruce planks. And let's also make the ceilings a little bit higher. So we're deep underground. We could afford having the ceilings a little bit higher. So let's cut the ceilings right there. And let's make these walls polished deep slate. Just like so. Boop. And also we lost our door. So I need to redo that. Not the door. Not the door. Hey, that's what I said. All right, but we speed run that. Okay, and done. And Shady, do you need any ideas for this room? No, I was just... Wait, actually, what rooms are you guys doing? Mia's making the entertainment room. Zoe's making the food room. The food room. The Zoe, this room is so small. This is the food room. And Shady, you can make our farms. We're gonna need some place where the food comes from. She's making a food room, then why would I make a farm? Should she put the farm in the food room? Because that's the storage. Okay, you know what? You guys figure that out. I'm gonna work on my room. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna make a farm gang, but you stay safe over there. Hey! I was just giving suggestions, okay? I want to give us a dance, okay? Yo! I want to give us a dance, okay? Nia, yeah, tell him to stop. <laughs> I can't help you out here, bro. <laughs> I'm done. Okay, I'm gonna need to make beds for all of us in this lodging room. So let's go right here and let's build some pillars on all sides just like this. And now we're gonna need to make these bunk beds. So I want to make these beds pretty big. We're gonna get, obviously, a bed for each of us. So let's get one bed of each of our colors. Place Cadge's bed right here. Mia's bed, Shady's bed, and hmm, the person in the middle will get the triple bed because that makes it more even. We should put our third at there. What? That's who gets that bed. Oh, true. Oh, but I want to be the third at because it's the triple bed. Nah, Cash almost married his third at. No, I chose the million dollars. Nah, bro got the million dollar mansion with free Wi-Fi and his third at. Wait, what? I'm so confused. Okay, right here, I'm going to place the dark oak slabs on the top like this. And now we need to place Zoe's bed, which I'll put Zoe's in the middle and then Mia's bed. And then we're going to place one last bed right here. Guys, I'm going to make it a green bed for Mebo. Cool. Mebo. All right, and now that is done. So now we can place ladders on both sides real quick. We probably want a column on these sides right here so that we could lead into this. And let's place the ladders going into it like that. Now let's expand these. And I have some details that I could add as well. I could add these little buttons right here, which just makes this look even better. Even though we're trying to be practical right now, we still want to make it aesthetic because we're going to be living down here for a long time. All right, we're going to need to get these spruce stairs. And let's go like this. And that looks good. Let's do the same thing on the other side. Perfect. And now we can do the same thing underneath here. Done. And now that looks good. That is all of our beds. I think I want to name them too. That would be cool. I'm going to play signs for all of us. First, we can start off with Mebo's bed. So I'm going to name this Mebo's bed. And then we can just do that with all of our other beds. So we got Zoe's. Then we got Mia's. Then we have Shady's. And lastly, do not put my bed anywhere next to Mia's. She's a snorer. Dude, occasionally. Then we have mine. And then we have Cash's. Now, all we have to do is just make these colors look good. So let's glowing sack all this text. And perfect. Now all of our beds are labeled. All right. Now, usually in the bedroom, is the same area where we usually have the closet. So let's make a little closet area. Before we do that, I want to place some light gray carpet right in here. That just fills up this room a lot better. And then on this side, I'm going to place a little painting right here. Let's actually get some stairs and slabs and make a little area where we could place some plants. Let's just make this place look a little bit more homey. And that painting is perfect. Now we could get some flower pots, place flowers on both sides, and that looks good. All right, now time to build the closet. I want to make this out of dark oak planks, so and we're going to cut this room in half, just like so. And then we're going to place some spruce slabs on the top. Up like this, and then place the spruce planks above it. This divides the whole room so that there's some privacy for anyone that's in the closet. And then I want to place some doors right here.
here. And we're gonna have multiple doors so that multiple people can change at one time if needed. Now we're gonna separate these rooms by adding a fence that divides this. And a mud wall is perfect because it allows for more space in each room. And that looks good. All right. And then now I probably need to make these walls a little bit higher just to make this look a little bit better. Then I wanna place a roof for this thing. Let's go for mud bricks. And let's place this roof going all the way across. So, and this is starting to look good. Now when you enter, it looks like this. But there's no clothes. So we're gonna place some armor stands here. Armor stands. Perfect. Obviously, we need some clothes. So I'm gonna get a Nico and Cash shirt. And you can actually get these at CashNico.com. Look at that. That's beautiful. And here's the Cash shirt too. We could also add some diamond armor to this thing and some helmet to each of these. But actually, I think Cash probably wants another right to armor with his Cash shirt. All right. And that looks good. And then for mine, I also want the diamond armor. So let's get full gold armor for Shady. Actually, I know Shady really likes another right, so I'll just give him another right. Shady doesn't have to have gold on everything. But I know Zoe likes her amethyst armor, so I'm just gonna give her that. And we don't have a fifth one, so Mia, you're just gonna have to keep her clothes in your pocket. My fault. Bruh! And Shady looks like he built the farm. Yeah, I went ahead and decided to actually build a farm. I know. I told you it was good. And Zoe, what is this? Why is it cute? It's all purple. Yeah, I like it, right? You know what? We'll roll with it. Fine. Mia, how's the entertainment room going? Uh, someone's working on the boogie woogie room, but I'm doing something else. What do you mean the boogie woogie room? <laughs> No, definitely not. We're not doing that. Oh, it's happening. All right, this was originally going to be the escape pod, but we'll make the escape pod in a different area because I have an idea for a different room. I'm going to select right here, and I'm going to go all the way over. Oh, gosh. Uh, wait. I see the boogie woogie room. <laughs> yeah, leave it alone. Uh, I kind of spoiled it. No, no, no. I'm gonna go all the way over here, and I'm gonna select in this direction. Then I'm gonna go over here, and I'm gonna select in this, and let's just cut this out. Now we have a big room. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set the floor to sandstone. Then I'm gonna set the actual floor to sand. You might be wondering what I'm doing. Well, I'm gonna make an indoor beach, because we're probably gonna miss the water underground, so we need to get that somehow. We need to get our vitamin C. So let's place the walls with light blue concrete, just like how Shady did in his room. I kinda wanna do something similar. So let's get some of his blocks, like this. And now we could use it as inspiration towards our room. So, let's obviously make the roof light blue concrete as well. Okay, and then now, let me see. What did you do for the cloud, Shady? Oh, I like this, Shady. You made the clouds in the sky. I sure did. That is a good idea. So, I'm gonna place some clouds in the sky like this. And I wanna make these look very natural. So, let's just go on the roof and place them accordingly. Doesn't have to be too complicated, but still good enough where, where it looks like they're actual clouds. And let's place the last cloud right here. That looks good. Alright, we have the clouds of the sky now. Alright, we're gonna set this part of the room to water. And then we're gonna go and place some water along the edges like this. Oh, we don't want any of that. We want it to all stay on one ground. That looks good. And that looks good. And then right here, we're gonna add some beach chairs. So let's get some chairs and let's just add these all across the beach. Perfect. And we're gonna build an umbrella on each of these. So let's get a fence. When the sunshine was shining in a... Okay, Cash. Sorry. And then I'm gonna get a structure void. Wait, what have you been building? Oh, don't worry about it. Do not check on me. Are you making the buggy wuggy womb? Nuh uh. Just, you'll see later. I have a feeling you are. Mm -mm. I got a structure void so I could build this thing. All right, now I'm gonna place this umbrella like this. Let's make this pattern. The structure voids allows us to place the carpet in the air. If we don't have the structure void below, then it won't let us place the carpet. So we go like this. That's perfect. And then now let's set a wand right here and let's copy this design and paste it on all the different chairs. And done. All right, that is looking good. I think we could remove one on the edge because I think that's doing too much. We can place one chair right here. Now we have five chairs for the, each of us. The next thing I wanna do is we can make a little volleyball court right here too. So let's go right here and add a little net. We could do that by adding some cobwebs like this. That looks good. And then we obviously want to make the line. So let's get some sandstone. And this sandstone will indicate where the line is. Obviously, you can't see it very well, but it's something. We can even add some redstone around to make it look like an actual line. There we go. That looks good. Now our volleyball court is done. And that looks good. The very last thing we need is an exit. So I think I want to make the exit behind the entrance. That would be good. In case we need to get out of here in case any aliens invade this place. All right. I'm going to replace this wall with polished deep slate. Boom. That looks good. And let's keep breaking this wall right here. We're gonna make this lead to the surface. We actually need to go farther because I'm pretty sure we have the other side of our base here. So let's keep digging. Then now we wanna cut and then we wanna replace all the walls with polished deep slate. So let's go. Select over here. Select over here. Now we can replace and we can just fill in all the holes that are in this place. Since there's obviously holes in the caves. All right, that looks good. Now we wanna replace the floor with some quartz block. And we're gonna make a little cool escape here. We're gonna break right here. And we're gonna break all the way to the surface. And oh gosh, hopefully there's no aliens out here. Okay, we're good. Okay, we're gonna add a ghost block right here. And we're gonna place four actually. We're gonna go like this. Okay, nice. I don't think any aliens are 
million zombies, so we're good. And then now we want to replace all the blocks leading up to this thing to be polished deep slate. And oh gosh, I totally forgot about this. There we go, patched up. Now that's looking good. So what we're going to do on the bottom right here is we're actually going to make a little cannon to launch us up and get us out of here. So let's get some dispensers and let's place four dispensers like this. And then what we could do is we could place all the water that we need right here. Mia, why did you say buggy wuggies? Nah, she buggy wuggy. <laughs> I'm buggy wuggy right now. No, what's going on? You don't want to know. <laughs> buggy wuggy. I need to see what you guys are doing after this. Whoop, whoop. Okay, now we need to actually focus on the cannon part of this thing. So we're going to put TNT in all of this stuff. TNT, 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 and fill all of this dispensers. Okay, boom. Now whenever we flick a lever, we shouldn't be worried because we have water and all those things. So now if it explodes, we're good. All I have to do is get a fence right here. Place some fences like this. And then I want to place some carpet. So then you can jump on top of it. Like so. And then now whenever you flick the lever. Boom. Check this out. Boom. And we can get out of here. That is actually a perfect explosion too. All right. We have finished the exit. Which means I think our base is finally completed. We have Mia's entertainment room. And wait. We even have a Cash Nico comic book here. That's cool. And we have a TV. And then we have Zoe's food room right here. Which has all the storage and all our food necessities. Then over here. We have my bedroom, which we're all gonna sleep at. Shady's farm. And lastly, my beach. So, uh, what was the room you guys were talking about? Oh, your secret boogie boogie room? Yeah, where is it? Boogie woogie. It's hidden in the wall. Wait, what is this? You gotta find it. Wait, where did you guys go? Right here. Wait, what? Not over there, silly. Enjoy. Wait, Mia, there's nothing. No, no, just go right there. Okay. What is this? Boogie woogie. Zoe, you built all of this. Oh, I did not build this. Enjoy. No, it was definitely me or Shady that built this thing. Yo, get your bookie on, Nika. You know you want to. Okay! Yeah! Yeah! Wait, uh, guys, I'm in survival. Oh. Oh, gosh, me too. Oh, gosh, did our creative keys run out? All right, it is time for us to survive in this bunker. Okay, uh, where do we go? Wait, how do we get out? Wait, Mia. Yo, who blocked us? Someone blocked us in! Hey, yo! Yo! Yo, let us out! Let us out! Oh, we finally got out of there. Okay, we should be good. And we're looking good! There's aliens outside! Wait, what? They're here? Wait, Shady, are you checking out your cams? Oh, gosh, we gotta run. Get down! Oh, wait, no. They're both out there. Okay, we should be good. We have to let them in! Wait, oh, gosh. Guys! Guys, get in the bunker! Flick at it! <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Go, 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 go down! How do you go down? Not the alien, not the alien. Guys! Hey! Ow! Oh, gosh. Okay. Go down, go down, go down! What happened? Guys, the alien! Behind you! Ah! Ah! Oh, my God! Oh, oh gosh. Guys, just eliminate all of them. Yeah, I'm trying. Dude, they're not leaving us alone. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good at this bunker now. Now nah, they're gonna take those cows. Oh, gosh, the alien! Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, wait. Wait, wait, he's talking. Wait. Wait, she, don't shoot. I won't, I'm not. Listen, can we have peace for a little bit? I only want the orange one. Wait, the orange one? No, please. I have a life to live. Oh, yeah, yeah. Take her, take her, take her. We're good. No, no, don't take me, please. Excuse me that much a bit. You think it's funny to make jokes about my mother? I'm sorry. Your mom is great. Well, you didn't think the same thing when you said the moon was revolving around her. What? Um, she's awesome. She's awesome. Mia. You know what? Yeah, take her, put her in an incubator, do whatever. I have a better yo mama joke. Wait, what? Yo mama so dumb. She thought the Super Bowl was a cereal. Haha. <laughs> she brought a spoon to the Super Bowl, so that's how I explain the joke. Oh. You leave my mom alone. No. Okay, listen. We can have a truce. Yeah, no, let's truce. Uh. All right. Either way, I found some weird room in your guys' base. What? Where? Yeah, it kind of confused me. Follow me. It's back up. Oh, okay. It was through here. If you go past the trap doors. Wait, right here? And if I step on these pressure plates, it opens the doors. Wait, what? Ah! Uh, what is all this? What is this? What just happened? We're in the back rooms. Oh, no. How do we get out? Oh, I can't get out! No! It's forever! We're stuck! All those bunkers were absolutely insane! Yeah, but see, they all got destroyed like this one. Yeah, I mean, I guess you're right. Ah, uh, Phobos! No, no, not again, not again! Ah! Oh! If you want to watch more Nico Catch Adventures, click on the screen. If you enjoyed, then please subscribe! Bye, guys. Subscribe. Bye! Bye.